up everybody it's JP uh, today is Wednesday uh, I'm doing part two of the uh, uh, limb riser install this is uh, where I'm modifying or actually custom making pieces for the uh, Kobe rack so I already made one and then I'm gonna show you how I made it and uh, so this is it right there I have the um, quick release on the Gobi rack so that's how it's mounting behind it between it actually between the uh, quick release and the rack and that's the uh, custom piece that I made right here all right so I'm going to show you a couple of the pieces that I already prepped and then uh, do the other side and uh, show you the steps that I did to make it all right so here's the one that I made basically just still rough they gotta clean it up and uh, soften up the edges and everything but this is the uh, rough template so dimensions of these pieces three and five eighths and this is four inches just put a mark up here measure it make sure it's three and five eighths That's my line, and I'm just going to trim that off. Yep. Good. Right, I'm going to take off the, uh, the quick release on the Gobi rack. I've already pre loosened it, makes it a little easier. Here's the uh, part of the rack. I'm just gonna flush it on the side and flush it on the bottom. And just mark my holes. Like so. Alright, so I gotta drill out those holes. Once I have those, then I just put on the side piece, we'll weld that up, and then uh, it's good to go. So, alright. side piece that's going to have the uh, wire connected to. I already pre-cut this out. Okay. So I'm just going to grind out and clean this up and round it off like I got the other one.
so we got now the arm, the piece that comes out from the rack. This is the piece that goes behind it. Now I'm just going to hold it in place and then test the fit. and test the fit. So this is basically just the rough, basically a uh, piece that's made. I'm just gonna, you know, take my time, sand it up, and then paint it. Um, but basically that's it. So now I have my hole right here, and then it's gonna go down to there, so I can actually measure out and figure out um, what the size wire I need. Fifty-nine inches. All right, so fifty-nine inches from uh, that to there. So I'm gonna place that order, and then uh, next video will just be installed in cable. So. All right, so. Uh, that's it for part two of uh, the limb riser uh, modification and uh, the uh, custom piece. So I'm going to order the wire and then next step will just be uh, test fitting the wire and make sure that's all good. But uh, making those brackets is pretty simple. Um, just I just used some scrap uh, sheet metal that I had that uh, from the trailer and um, just did a little bit of measuring and that was pretty much it. It's pretty simple. So uh, basically the cost for that was nothing. So definitely saving some money there. All right, if you like this video, please uh, hit the like button, uh, subscribe to follow along to uh, some other modifications and just stuff that we're doing for the Jeep and the uh, trailer to try and get it uh, ready for the uh, spring and the summer. Thank you very much for tuning in and uh, watching this episode. Um, you can uh, see some of the other episodes of some of the other stuff we've done to the Jeep. Just uh, click on those. And uh, if you want, share this video with anybody you think might like it. All right. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.